कारवा मिनी नमा दुष्कृति नो मूढ़ा प्रपद्यंते नाधमा मयया परत आसुरम भावश्रिता दोज मिस्क्रीन्स वर ग्रॉसली फूलिश लोएस्ट अमंग मैन काइंड हूज नॉलेज इज टोलन बाय इल्यूजन एंड यू पार टेक ऑफ द एथीस्टिक नेचर ऑफ डीमन्स डू नॉट सरेंडर अन टू मी सो सम पीपल विल ऑलवेज कीप ऑन सफरिंग इन दिस वर्ल्ड they will not be able to surrender unto krishna first category is moodha moodha means an as an as carries lot of load traditionally the washerman would pile up loads of clothes on the back of an as an as will very dutifully carry the loads of clothes just for a morsel of grass an as is not able to think why am i working so hard the same path that i tread every day on either side I have lot of grass. I can just go there, roam and eat as much as I want. But this sense does not awaken in as that is why as is called an as mood of foolish. He will work so hard thinking if I do not work so hard then I will not be able to eat and maintain myself. Grass can only come from washerman. Otherwise I will starve. This is ignorance. Similarly, those people who work very hard to enjoy all the results of their activities they do not want to offer the results of their work partake a part of their results with god they are called moodhas such people often tell oh i do not have time to understand bhagavad gita so many people who give such reasons because they are so busy to produce more and more results they want to enjoy everything for themselves and they always complain of lack of time such hard working people they cannot surrender to krishna second category is न माम दुष्कृतिनो मूढ़ा प्रपद्यंते नराधमा नर अधम लोएस्ट ऑफ द मैन काइंड सो दोज पीपल हु आर नॉट एडवांस्ड इन सिविलाइजेशन नॉट एडवांस्ड इन सोशल रेगुलेशंस इकोनॉमिक डिवेलपमेंट और रिलीजन दे आर कॉल्ड अनसिविलाइज पीपल द ट्राइबल्स एंड इवन दो पर्सन इज वेरी एडवांस्ड सोशली और इकोनॉमिकली बट नॉट एडवांस्ड इन टर्म्स ऑफ रिलीजन they are also called naradhama this is a version of the vedas they are telling dharme nahi na pashu bhi samanah ahar nidra bhay maithunam evaja eating mating sleeping defending these are common pillars between men and animals the difference is dharma the instructions given by god if a person does not follow dharma then he is animal animal is helplessly controlled by the laws of nature next life is fixed what it is going to become and if a person does not follow dharma he or she will also be helplessly always they will be helpless in their lives will be controlled by the laws of nature and thus naradhama because they are completely helpless like animals these people also will not be able to surrender to krishna so thus following religion and having a civilized life regulated life is very important third category is maya ya aparita gyana so these people have knowledge intelligence but their intelligence is stolen away by the illusory energy of krishna these class of people are very very learned very intelligent very scholarly and they would write commentaries also on bhagavad gita but because they are mis- miscreants dushkritina they are sinful their intelligence is taken away just like the person who is very uh who is a miscreant who creates trouble madmen they are given tranquilizers they become ignorant of the reality because if they are conscious of the reality they will create troubles for others and for themselves so they are put into illusion you sleep so thus maya because these people are miscreants dushkritina they are breaking the laws of nature by their sinful activities they are also their intelligence is taken away and they are also put into bewilderment and they cannot surrender to krishna and the last category is asuram bhavam ashrita who are proclaimed atheists some people openly declare i don't believe in god i don't uh, follow all these things they obviously cannot surrender so these people because they are dushkritina they are not able to surrender to krishna so having a life free from all the sins not breaking laws of nature is very important to surrender to krishna and there are four classes of people who are able to surrender who are these people that krishna explains next 
चतुर्विधावजंते माम जना सुकृतिनो अर्जुन आर्त जिज्ञासुरर्थार्थी ज्ञानी च भरत ओ बेस्ट अमंग द भारतास फोर काइंड्स ऑफ पायस मेन रेंडर डिवोशनल सर्विस अन टू मी द डिस्ट्रेस्ड द डिजायर ऑफ वेल्थ द इंक्विजिटिव एंड ही हु इज सर्चिंग फॉर द नॉलेज ऑफ द एब्जोल्यूट so sukriti is very important to come to god the illusory energy of krishna goddess durga maya devi does not allow miscreants criminals to approach god they will create but disturbance so those people who have pious backgrounds who follow the laws of nature the religion they are called sukritina and these people sometimes when they are art art means they are in distress they surrender unto god and also second category is artharthi when we are desirous of material achievements give me success material wealth success in some examination or a good job or good life partner these people also go to god approach god when we are hungry oh god give us our daily bread so those people who are in distress those people who have material desires if they are sukritina they approach god surrender to god but these two categories are not very mature they may deviate from the path of god realization at any time when they become little happy or the material desires are fulfilled or if they are frustrated they may go away but next two categories they are important they stick to this process next third category is jigyasu some people they become frustrated from these material affairs who oh, have got success also sometimes i have not got success also but the satisfaction is not there there is frustration in life so in this frustration they become inquisitive so let me understand what is this bhagavad gita who is god what is this world what is real happiness so these inquis- inquisitive souls also if they are sukritina they surrender unto god and the most advanced category is gyani philosopher one who is searching after absolute truths they also surrender to 